Now, the Lagos Chamber of Commerce and Industry says it will continue to engage with the state and federal government in all matters of policies that will improve the economy and address concerns of the business community. The new president and chairman of the Council of the Chamber, Gabriel Idahosa, stated this while speaking with journalists shortly after his investiture. Plus TV correspondent Love Ikuku Oyedokon was there and now reports. It was a two-in-one event for the Lagos Chamber of Commerce and Industry, LCCI. Celebration of its 135th anniversary and the investiture of Mr. Gabriel Idahosa as the 43rd president of the chamber. Adorned in different colorful attires, members of the LCCI community turned out in the large numbers to grace the occasion as the outgoing president, Michael Olawale Cole, transfers the reins of leadership to the new president. The moment was indeed that of mixed feelings for both men. The Lord will give you strength. He will give you the He will give you all the elements to be extraordinary. And you will be very, very uncomfortable person in Jesus' name. In an emotional laden speech, the former LTCI boss ruminated on the journey so far. He urged members and staff to give unflinching support to the new president to succeed in his role. Please, as you have done for me, you stood by me the last two years, please stand by my, by my brother. It's my twin brother, uh, Gabriel. I love him with passion. We met in the chamber, but I love him with passion. Please, as you have supported me for the last two years, please stand by him and see that it takes the chamber to the next level. Gabriel Idahosa is a new SCI president. For him, the investiture marked not just a destination, but a continuation of a journey filled with possibilities, growth, and new horizons. I am relying and expecting the, the energy that is in the chamber among our officers, among the staff to continue to be at a very high level. The president cannot do anything without the management of LCCI and the officers on my executive. So I am as good as the executive and the council. So I expect that that energy that we have will continue to be there for me and I will give every reason for them to continue to support us because clearly I will reflect their aspirations in everything we do. Taking over the mantle of leadership at a time Nigeria is trying to overcome numerous challenges, Idahosa assured that he will continue to reflect the aspirations of members in every aspect. Clearly, in 135 years, uh, the Lagos Chamber of Commerce has risen to a certain level of responsibility in this economy of advocacy, of uh, working with the state, the Lagos state and the federal government on major economic issues. So that tradition will remain. We will continue to engage with the Lagos state government. We will continue to engage with the federal government on all matters of policies that can improve our economy and address any concerns that the business community has. That is our mandate and that is what we will continue to do. The SCCI boss stressed that he hopes to draw greatly from the well of historic legacies of the founding fathers and also embrace the realities of the present to uplift the chamber's brand. Love Ikuku Oyedoku plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.